wanted to give you an update about a repair that I had to have on my Cybertruck very recently. And this is something that's a, a little unique. I don't know if uh, other people are going to have this issue or not, but I thought I would make this quick video and talk about what exactly happened and why I had to get that repaired. Now, early on uh, last year when the Cybertrucks were being produced and we saw the release candidates running around Giga Texas, one of the things that I was able to see is on the top of the tonneau cover, right at the point where it's matching up to about where the glass roof is, that there were some marks. And it was about a 12 inch long uh, mark. That's about, uh, call it 30 centimeters, about uh, two inches wide, which is about five centimeters wide. And it looked like it was kind of a discoloration with scratching. And I wasn't sure exactly what that was. I, and as they started making uh, the production, I didn't see that anymore. However, with my particular Cybertruck, as you can tell by this image, I was having that same problem. And uh, I tried to restrict the use of my tonneau cover as much as I could because it seemed like the scratches were getting worse. Now, in my visit here at the factory on the 3rd of July, uh, I did mention that to the Cybertruck team and they actually came out, they took some photos and looked at it and they said that it was definitely something that was uh, not correct, that I needed to get it replaced. And I know that they took a lot of notes for that as well. So if you have that problem, hopefully they will at least know what the, what the issue is. So anyway, I uh, did take it into service. I took it in Tuesday of this week, it took them about two days to get it completed and it was a uh, a replacement of the entire tonneau cover mechanism itself and I also got some of the recall items taken care of at the same time but uh, what I heard from the uh, repairman at the uh, Tesla sales and service location here in San Antonio was that uh, where the tonneau cover retracts in as uh, there's kind of a, a bolt type uh, structure that it rolls up in and on two places there are rods that go along this uh, kind of bowl or cylindrical receptacle for the tonneau cover and there's a noise vibration and harshness pad that's supposed to be around those rods and what was happening in my particular case is one of the rods was slightly bent which means it was touching that particular part of the tonneau cover and every time it rolled down it was kind of scraping it along and causing that problem so anyway the repair was uh, to get the tonneau cover completely replaced it seems to be working great now and with this image here i just took uh, moments ago you can see that there is no longer a mark on the top part of the tonneau cover so anyway, again, I don't know how frequent this problem is going to come along or if any other people have noticed it. But if you do, that is what the repair is right now and what it entails to get that uh, corrected. So anyway, I just wanted to uh, pass that along. Hopefully you found that useful. I also wanted to say thank you to the Cybertruck team here at Giga Texas for taking a look at that and uh, kind of giving, my, giving me my, their recommendation of what was needed. And also I wanted to thank the Tesla service store down in San Antonio for doing a great job. So anyway, I hope uh, this was useful and thank you very much for watching. Take care.